Shalom, Ka Allah, La, Yahweh, Bashum, Yahweh Shah. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well. And salutations to the hopeful elect that teach this truth sincerely across the four corners of the earth. Man, and um, so lucky with that. But you know, I'm about to just get in straight to scriptures, man, because the Spirit got on me to do this video. And this Jeremiah chapter 10, verse 2. Thus saith the Lord, learn not the way of the heathen. Who are the heathens, man? Who are the heathens? The heathens are these other nations, man. These people, the Gentiles, who's not Israelites. Them are the heathens, man. And what, what is two-thirds doing? They they learning the way of the heathen, man. They 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 following the heathen customs, man. You see two-thirds out here celebrating these pagan holidays, um, stuck in Christianity, man. Got dreads, lineups, man. Doing the ways of the heathen, man. And that's what our people in, man. You know, and I and well what's and our people don't even know that the shit wicked, man. They just doing it just to do it, or just they they just been taught the wrong way. But guess what though? That's why Hosea 4 6 say my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge, man. They destroy for lack of knowledge because they don't know shit. That's why they go get destroyed. That's why two thirds go get destroyed because they don't know shit, man. And I got a um, quick precept real quick. That I'm about to get into some articles real quick, man. This um Proverbs chapter 13, verse 20. He that walketh with wise men. Who is wise man, man? The man who know the truth. The man of the Lord, man. The man who know everything wicked, man. You know, the man that's in the house of mourning, man, like the scriptures say. Why they in the house of mourning? Because we know this shit wrong, man, and our people stuck in it. All right, it say, shall be wise. So the wise man shall be wise. And well, what the scriptures also say, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge. So if you fear the Lord, man, you're not going to be caught up in none of this shit in the world, man. You're going to be doing this shit, man. Well, I'm not shit, but you know what I meant. Salak, you. But you know what I meant, man. You're going to be doing the, the will of the Heavenly Father, man. Coming back to your true power. Yahweh Bashun, Yahweh Shah, man. Um, it say, but a companion of fools shall be destroyed. Now, who are fools? The ones that's in the house of mirth, like the scriptures say. The ones that's living happy, man. The ones that's dead, man. The ones that don't know nothing, man. And I'm talking about spiritually dead, man. Mentally dead, man. And I got some articles, man, because tonight Halloween, man, and that that's, you know, it's Jake will be out there celebrating this Halloween, man. That's the way of the heathen, man. This they holidays, man. That's this. This is they customs. And I'm going to just get into this article about how Halloween even came about. Um, Bear with me. All right. So where did Halloween even come from? Ancient, uh, ancient origins of Halloween's origin date back to the ancient Celtic festivals of South Sowing. The Celts who lived 200 years ago in the area that is now Ireland, the U United Kingdom, and no Northern France. Celebrated their new year on November 1st. So this this is where this is how the Halloween started man, you know um, This is a little piece of it, but I'm about to get into some more details, but November 4th, 1st November 1st was the Celtics um new year and their New Year's Eve was um, December, I mean um October 31st, you know Halloween man and if you look in that word hollow, it means it really means holy, but ain't shit about this shit holy. So why the fuck is it called Halloween, man? That is like the scriptures say Esau turned everything upside down. And hold on, I'm about to get in. There's another article. I'ma start right here. It say Halloween developed from an ancient pagan festival. An ancient pagan festival. That's where Halloween came from. That's how you know it's a pagan holiday. Celebrated by Celtics over 2,000 years ago in the area that is now 
the United Kingdom, Ireland, and Northwest France. That's what we just read on the other little thing um page. Now it's showing a whole article with more details, man. That's how you know this shit wicked, man. And our people caught up in it, man. That's a damn shame, man. The the scriptures clearly say don't follow the way, don't learn the way of the heathen. Good. What what our people do, man? No fucking knowledge, man. Lack of knowledge, man. Let me keep reading. Um, the festival was called sowing, which means summer's end. The festival marked the beginning of dark winter seasons and was celebrated around November 1st. In the 1800s, I mean, it's a lot. In the 800s, the Christian church, hold on, hold on. Who... Who 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 started the Christian Church, man? The Roman the Romans, man. The Roman Catholic Church, man. And Catholic mean universal, man. Along with the pagans, man. They started that shit, man. They started this Christianity shit, man. That's how you know this paganism, man. It even said pagan festival, a pagan festival, man. Establish a new holiday, All Saints Day. On this day, All Saints Day was also called All Hallows. Hollows means saint. So what I just said, hollows means saint or holy. But this shit not holy if it's paganism in it. Or one who is holy. One who is, and holy means separate, man. This shit not separate because everybody doing it. Like the scripture say, the devil shall deceive the whole world. The evening before all hollows was known as all hollows eve. That's what that, well, October 31st, that's all That's all Hallows Eve and All Hallows Day is November 1st. You know, they New Year. Or as it came to pass, abbreviated All Hallows E, in, All Hallows in, in, this name was eventually shortened to Halloween. And that's how Halloween came about from a fucking pagan festival, man. And now let's look at the, let's look up this this uh, Samhain this Samhain character. Um, it's a lot. Damn, I don't have it with me. But basically, that Samhain man, the Samhain, 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 how it's pronounced. That that's a that's just a god. That's just another idol, man. That's a, just another idol or people worship, man. Sowing, man. That's what, and it came. It came from the heathens, the Edomites, you know, the pagans, man, the Roman Catholic Church, man. So long. That's the and, you know, if you do some research on sowing, man, you can see videos of they doing rituals to sowing, man. That's how you know that shit wicked. It, it came from a pagan, a pagan god, man. Halloween. That's where it came from, a pagan festival, man. Right here, man. And our people celebrating that shit. But, you know, let's get back into some scriptures now. We just did some little research on it. Oh, it's a lot. But, yeah. Um, I'm going to start with First John. Chapter 2. This first John chapter 2 verse 15. Love not the world, neither the things that are in the world. What's these holidays, these pagan holidays, these religions, these Christianities. All this shit is in the world, man. All of this is in the world. You know, celebrating your birthday, that's of the fucking world. Because that go back to Roman paganism, which is self-worship. If you do some research on that, man. That's of the world, man. It said, love not the world, neither the things that are in the world, man. So we're not supposed to love this shit. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. So if you love the world, you don't love Yahweh Bashan Yahweh Shah. You hate Yahweh Bashan Yahweh Shah. Because you either with it or you against it, man. You know. But um, like the scriptures say, you can't do nothing... You only can do something for the truth, not against the truth. But if you hate this truth, you either hate this truth or you love it, man. It's no. If you wanna be, you you wanna be against it, man. 
you know, and like, like James 4 and 4 say, the friend of the world is the enemy of the Most High. You know, and these pagan holidays, this shit is of the world, you know. Along with this Halloween, because it's Halloween today, man. That's really why I did this video, you know, because it was Halloween and I wanted to rebuke this shit. But this um St. John... No, before I get that, I'm gonna hold that. I'm gonna close it off with that. But let me get one more scripture. This um Revelations chapter ten, no chapter eleven, verse eight. And their dead bodies shall lie in the great in the streets of the great city, man. What's sick great city? That's about this place, Babylon, man. Confusion, man. That's that's whole fucking confusion right there, man. It's it's a hollow means holy or saint, but this shit celebrated all over the fucking world. But I thought it was holy, and holy means separate, man. And this this place, Babylon, America, this that great city, and it said their dead bodies shall lie in it. What's that talk about? That's about Israel, man. Two thirds of Israel, man. They they dead. They spiritually dead in this truth, man. And they go and they lying in this great city, man. Cause they don't know shit. They don't know no knowledge. That's why they go get destroyed. See, they spiritually dead right now, but soon coming up near future, they gonna be physical dead too in these streets, man. Cause they don't know shit. They gonna get destroyed, man. They gonna get smoked by Yahweh, by Shun Yahweh Shah, man. And I'm about to close it out with this. This John chapter fifteen verse eighteen. If the world hate you, this Yahweh Shah speaking. If the world hate you, ye know that it hated me before it hated you. So Yahweh Shah saying, if so, we against this truth, right? I mean, Salat, we against the world, right? So Yahweh Shah saying, if the world hate us, since we against it, since we since we with this truth, they hate us. They against us. They are enemy. They they not with us. You know. Like the scriptures say, the third, that third and fourth generation that hated me, and that first and second of the thousands that love me, and that thousands talk about the elect. You know, two thirds of Israel hate the elect right now. They, they the elect's enemy right now, and yeah, that's what Yahusha was saying. He was saying, if the world hate you, ye know it hated me before it hated you. So know that it hated him before it hated you, man. Know that these heathens and these these, uh, these other nations and the two thirds of Israel hated. Him before they hated us, man. If Lord willing, we are part of that elect, man. You know, because we with this truth and they against it. So, verse 19 If ye were of the world, the world will love his own. So, it's saying if, if we are of the love, you know, the world will love us, man. And we'll love it, man. We'll be with the world and against this truth. But because ye are not of the world, but I have chosen you out of the world. Therefore, the world hateth you. So, Yahweh Shah saying, it, it, the world hated him before it hated us. So, when he chose us out of the world, it went, it hated us now because it, it was already beefing with him. So, now the world beefing with us. You know, that's a gift to, to be chosen out of the world, man. You know, and but celebrating these pagan ass holidays and shit, that shit is of the world, man. You know, that shit wicked as fuck. But yeah, man. That was just my whole point, man. You know, I I, I hope all y'all niggas out there that's celebrating this Halloween shit, man. I hope y'all niggas get punished for this shit tonight or tomorrow or something, man. Soon. That's about two-thirds of Israel because them other nations, we already gonna fuck y'all up. But I'm talking about two thirds of Israel, man. I hope they pick um fucking poison in the candy or some shit, you know. Fuck up all the kids or some or some clown come out sewers, some real life, some it shit. Capture y'all niggas or shooting or some toxic thing. Something happen, man. I want something crazy to happen through the spirit of your how about showing you how it's shot, man. I'm praying. That something happened, man. I'm gonna put a man, Lord. I'm gonna put a curse on this shit, man. You know that something happened to you, you two third niggas, man. So, cause y'all niggas need it, man. Y'all need to get punished for this shit, man. Y'all been warned many times, man. 
Y'all, y'all don't even want to know shit. Y'all rejecting it. That's why y'all being. Dis- that's that's why y'all gonna be destroyed because y'all rejected this shit. Not shit, Salakia, man. But yeah, man. Um, you know, I just hope y'all niggas get punished for this shit. But yeah, I hope this video was edifying. And with that, I'm gonna start off. Saying Kala Allah La Yahweh Bashun Yahweh Shah. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who will will. And salutations to the hopeful elect that pierces too sincerely across the four corners of the earth. And Yahweh Bashun Yahweh Shah Barakatham to you brothers out there that's um teaching this truth, man, the elect, man. And pray for shortened days, man. I want all you brothers out there to pray for some some shit to happen here in Babylon, man. Or somewhere in the world. Somewhere, something big, man. I hope here in Babylon, man. So, you niggas that's celebrating this pagan shit. But yeah, with that, I'm going to just say Shalom.